Hello everyone! Welcome to my Coco Candle channel. So, here you will have a snapshot of the products that I use in terms of soap, shower gel, lotion, fragrance mist, and also some hand wash. So, this is just a show and tell type of video wherein I'll just show you what I've got and just tell you briefly uh, what I think about those products and then eventually um, show you again the entire thing. So, <clears throat> I've been into Bath and Body Works um, products lately, not only the candles but also some of their famous uh, lotions and um, body wash. I do also order on online, and um, I don't order as much as I as I can because they're also very expensive. If you compare the prices, if you buy it, whenever I hear you that you've just went to the semi annual sale, so it really hurts me whenever I see the price, compare the price that I pay as compared to the price that you pay. So I just want to tell you that this are. I'll be showing you not only Bath & Body Works, but also some of the products that I can easily buy from this end. So I have used up like um, some of them, so you'll see some of the bottles which is like halfway, but some are still full. So let me just go through it and not, not ramble <laughs> as I go along. Here, this is um, the Bath & Body Works Antibacterial anti um, Hand Wash. I'll just tilt it this way. So this is the, the first one that I'm almost about to finish. It's Exotic Rainforest. So this one is a combination, I think, of floral and some green green notes in it. It's a, it's a pleasant um, hand wash, so I really like it. This one, I really heard so many things about the Winter Candy Apple. It's also an antibacterial gentle foaming hand wash. Um, the packaging is really so cute. There's a reindeer and a metallic red um, wallpaper at the back. And for some reason, the hand wash I love, but the fragrance mist I don't like. Um, maybe because it's been in stock for a long time. So that's the only thing that for when, you, when you're able to buy something um, from here, then you cannot be sure in terms of the <clears throat> quality because you don't know whether it's been there for a month or two months or more than that. So it's really a hit or miss and you just have to take the risk every time you buy here international made products. So this one I really love. So this one I will repurchase someday. I also am using Actually, uh, this one is really very good. I notice in Bath & Body Works, every time they have any fragrance that has coconut, then you can be assured 100% that it's going to be a good buy. Um, they do the mix of coconut with another fruit. Like this one is coconut lime verbena. This is uh, antibacterial um, foaming soap as well. I'm enjoying this. Um, actually, this is inside the... The guest bathroom or my daughter's bathroom um, one large pump would last me for a long time it depends I noticed the one I use in the office would would uh, finish faster like three weeks or a month but the ones that you put in the bathroom uh, would would um, last for a longer time so this one has been there for a month more than a month and I have not finished it yet Another one that is in the guest bathroom is the Mango Mai Tai. This is also an antibacterial gentle foaming wash. I think I do prefer personally the gentle foaming wash than the creamy moisturizing wash, um, hand wash. Um, I don't know because it was just very recently that I tried that in the office. But the one I have in the office is actually Peach Bellini. And... Um, it smells good and it feels so nice after you use it, but um, I think for me, um, it's faster and easier to use the, the foaming. So the, the packaging is so cute. It's so oriental, so tropical, so 
it's nice. I like this. Um, I have also finished like two of their shower gel. You may laugh at me, but it was just my first time to try the Bath and Body Works um shower gel signature collection. This is a ten ounce uh, two or two hundred ninety five ml container. Uh, coconut lime breeze. I bought this here locally. Um, I think it was around four hundred fifty local currency. So that's around twelve U.S. dollars per bottle. So you know now why it's cheaper for me at times to order online so it really depends you'll just have to do your mathematics and just to calculate the cost plus the shipping and then figure out the unit price and then you will decide whether you would like to buy online or would you would like to buy locally for this i think i did not discover yet the world of ebay so i did order this or sorry i did buy this off the rack here in one of the grocery stores oh this one when you when you use it in your shower, I'm sure you all know, you just get this burst of cocoa lime breeze. Literally, like you are taking a shower under coconut juice and someone is sprinkling lime into the shower. So this, I would love to buy one box of coconut lime breeze. It's just perfect. It's just, it's just, give, just gives me lots of energy and it's the right time to start the day. Another very nice signature collection, uh, as you all agree, I've seen a lot that you love cucumber uh, melon shower gel. Um, at, at first I thought it was always a must that you have to buy shower gel plus the lotion plus the fragrance mist, but it's really up to you, up to your preference. So for me, even having just a shower gel is more than enough for you to enjoy that specific scent. But for this one, I do have uh, the body lotion as well of the same scent. So I guess I use them back to back. So once I have uh, used the shower gel, then I finish it up with the body lotion. But it's really up to you. But I don't have the fragrance mist, so this too will be able to provide enough layer layering for me to enjoy the scent for quite a long time, for quite a long time. Like when, when I use it, let's say in the morning, and then I use it, and then I apply the lotion, you will still smell yourself for the next five hours, and it smells really good. Um, let me go to some of my soaps. As I've said, I'll be featuring some of my uh, soaps that I purchased. I think this is L'Occitan. I bought this from one of my trips. It's a very um, known and common product in, in Europe. And they carry a lot of high-end products. Uh, my favorite actually um, that, that I use, it's the Lavender Hand Cream. Luckily, I get free supply from that from, from, from a dear, dear friend of mine. And... Um, I do have right now in front of you showing this to you the, the soap. I don't know, but this one, it's like an unscented soap. So maybe I couldn't understand what the French word means here, but maybe it smells, means unscented. But anyway, it's just worth to show you what I've got as well. I have your five um, local scented soaps that um, I was able to buy in one of my shopping weekend trips. It's uh, named Organic and it's spelled with a Q-U-E at the end. So I think this is just a, a fruit salad um, soup bar. Um, it really smells good um, for a local product and it's good. You can see there the picture of uh, mixed fruits. You can see raspberries, strawberries, um, kiwi, oranges, uh, mangoes, melons, watermelon. So you can see... Here, the different um, cathedra cathedral look type uh, of soap bar. So, this is okay. Not too bad for the price, like like $1.25 or $1.50. Another one is uh, handmade soap. 
I think this is, uh, I, I don't know, there's no st sticker on this one. I think the lady said that this was um, Mok, M-O-K-E. It's like a local uh, floral, uh, sorry, local flower here. So it the smell is pleasant. And this one, as you can see, it's called uh, Peach Paradise. So I do love um, sweet peaches i love the actual fruit i even eat the fruit directly from the can because you, you can't buy easily peaches from here but in the soap form then uh, it's also very good um i mean it's okay for the price what can you expect um this one is called uh oh my god my eyes they're really very bad i cannot even read this so whatever it is it's a green soap Kind of smell the same as the peaches, maybe because they were in a drawer all at the same time. Is it rose? Is it moet? Moak? I don't know. So, oh, this one is called Ilang Ilang. So, this is a local flower as well. Mm, it's a strong uh, floral scent, but it's good. Uh, if you are a floral person, then definitely you will like that. So, actually, I have five five of my local soaps so I and I also have another set of five but they're in the shower so I cannot show them to you right now um, okay moving on you will see that I do have my signature vanillas and this one I will tell you that I am really really in love with all the signature vanilla I'll start with my le least favorite one, the berry signature vanillas. I'll I'll do them together. So I also have the shower gel plus the body lotion, and the and this I use alternately on a daily basis, and this one is really long lasting. The layering effect of the berry signature vanillas is just amazing. It just makes you really smell so good the whole day, the whole day. So. This, I will definitely buy some more of this if I have the chance. Second favorite of the signature vanillas is the apricot. Um, as you can see, I've been using it, so it's uh, below half already. But this one is also one scent that I am in love with. It's just so good. Whenever you put it, you smell like a very nice... Um, apricot lady walking around the street. I don't know if there's such thing, but it just smells so good whenever you use it. I'm just in love with this as well. But the most uh, favorite flavor is the lemon signature vanillas. Um, OMG. I don't know if I smell like a lemon meringue pie. I don't know if I smell like a a fresh lemon walking around the street but with a hint of vanilla but oh my god this I super not only love but super 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 love this one so this one I will definitely repurchase um I only have two of the Bath and Body Works um, fragrance mist, I think this is uh, the old packaging in coconut uh, lime breeze. I bought that because of this one, so that's my only layer layering part: shower gel and the fragrance mist. But I bought this a long time ago, like two months ago, and look at it. I'm not a fast user when it comes to fragrance mist. I noticed that. I use I prefer more the shower gels plus the lotion. So I ha I have the winter candy apple and for the winter candy apple um as I've said I I did try this but it was not very very strong so maybe it's an old stock so it's okay. I have a few more left. Um this one I bought locally the the Paris Amour uh Triple Moisturizing Body Cream. It takes me also a long time to use this because uh, it's very potent, so you just have to use a little bit. So I use it as a hand lotion, sometimes as a body lotion, but 